I think it went well. Um, we were able to get many people involved, uh, people we never met before, who just you know came in and started helping in the you know open source. Uh, approach very good as with every DAO sometimes people appear and disappear sometimes they take a task and they don't do it but we know that so we, we were ready not to be disrupted by that um, and I think people who helped now feel that they own part of this DAO so that that's the idea and that allows for more resilience um, so it doesn't depend on like my will or a few people's will, this could go on even without us in the future. Maybe it's too early for that, but that's the idea. And um, yeah, and it can be like a, a good framework for, for building something something much bigger. Of course, a DAO is harder than, than a company. Even Decentralized is harder than centralized. It's harder, slower, more expensive. Um, but once you build it, it's also more long-lasting. It's like building with uh, marble for 2,000 years against building for concrete for 100 years. So, and also it's interesting. I mean, this is, this is what we live for, I guess, like doing new things and, and just learning in the process. So I learned a lot again, so perfect. We are in the pre-DeFi summer of decentralized travel. So, lots of theories, some protocols, uh, lots of frustration, why nothing is happening, and uh, lots of conviction that something will happen, we just don't know when and how. So we are kind of waiting for the Uniswap moment in which everybody starts using one thing which cannot even exist in the legacy environment, something which you can't even conceive in the legacy environment. Um, we are still in the skeuomorphic, skeuomorphic phase where we try to do the same things with new technology uh, instead of doing things which were just not even conceivable with an old technology. Uh, so, well, let's see. Uh, we know it's going to happen and we're just waiting for the big surprise. That's where we are today with web train travel, in my opinion. And that makes us, uh, that puts us in a very, in an incredibly interesting position where, because when this happens, it's going to be a lot of fun. I can't because I won't decide. Uh, we won't decide as Chips community. What's going to happen is that People who helped during this uh, this conference and people who uh, bought uh, the, the NFT for the DAO have a vote. So we will open submissions for ideas. People will, you know, submit places and dates, and then people with NFT, so the DAO people who own this conference will vote, and we will go where the uh, the DAO decides. So I don't know. Uh, one of us already is proposing some specific place in Italy, and, and so it's going to be more explicit, I guess, in the next weeks. And I was talking to other people, and they were suggesting other places. Uh, I don't know, Turkey was mentioned, Bali was mentioned, and other places. Uh, a couple of people said Italy is great, so let's see. The DAO will decide. <laughs> <laughs>